Hey guys, what's going on? Smoking Fireman here. Um, I just wanted to give a quick update on some stuff, and this is also going to be a VR to Justin Taylor's 500 sub giveaway, so I'm going to kind of kill two birds with one stone. Real quick update on the box pass, just for the simple fact that uh, Justin Taylor is in the box pass. Um, I shipped it out um, last Monday or Tuesday, I believe. Anyway, um, nonetheless, they have it lost at a USPS sorting facility somewhere in Pennsylvania, and I have been trying to keep in touch with them and figure out what's going on and stuff like that. Luckily, I put insurance on the package, so if any if they can't find it, then I'll get reimbursed the money, and we'll just kind of have to start over. But it's um, it's going to be a little bit of a process. Nonetheless, it'll get going eventually here. I'm just kind of trying to see if uh, this box ends up coming back or not. But uh, it was the first stop was going to uh, Harriet Herfer. Anyway, um, like I said, this is going to be a VR to Justin Taylor for his 500 sub giveaway. Um, he wants to see uh, he wants to see our pipe collection. So I'm going to go ahead and pull out my pipes and show him what we have here. So, all right, Justin Taylor, this is my pipes. Um, I currently have a Fat Daddy pipe. That is coming in the mail as soon as I get pictures of it I will show it to everybody but um, anyway I have a country gentleman here that I have never smoked I have another country gentleman here I believe is what they're called um, this is the uh, uh, stubby cutty I think what it is this is the Cole Younger pipes that they came out with that's just a little um, just a little stubby pot, I forget what they call those, but it's unfinished. And then I have a Dagner Poker. Alright, on to this one. I also have a Bones Poker. This here is a little blowfish pipe that a buddy of mine made for me. I have a little Nording pipe there. It's got a pretty small bowl on it. A little puffer. This is another pipe here that is uh, a person made for me a gentleman he has a little pipe company it's called Marvik here is a little uh, Meerschaum pipe that I try out new balloons with this is my Briarworks pipe this is one of my favorites it's not my favorite but it's one of them got some beautiful grain on there these next two here these are both basket pipes this pipe here is actually my grandfather's. I'm gonna try to get it restored and start smoking it, but that was my grandfather's pipe. All right, we're gonna move on to the Boswells. So we have a Boswell bent egg here. We have a Boswell um, sitting pot. It's unsmoked. We have a Boswell freehand that is unsmoked. We have a Boswell's little devil ants that's been smoked. This is a this is a pretty decent sized pipe. It's like a it's almost like a, a billiard, but it's a it's a pretty big pipe. It's also from Boswell. It's unsmoked. We have this one here. It's another little bent egg and it's unsmoked. And this is my Boswell um, Lava Rock Shot Shell Pipe. It's got the, like the Lava Rock type finish to it. And it has a little 12 gauge shot shell and a nice uh, acrylic stem on it. My next two pipes and the bowls and stuff are the Hector Weeb pipes. This one here is the Hector Weeb with the brown chimney. This is one of the uh, Volcano bowls for it. I also have this black chimney. Um, when I got this pipe, I got it off of uh, Shelby, the Forgiven Piper, and it was matched up to this here. It was the Midnight Edition of the Hector Weed pipe. And then currently, my favorite pipe that I have, which that may change as soon as that Fat Daddy pipe gets here. I'll, like I said, I'll show everybody. But this is my Hector Weed pipe, and it's a custom uh, bowl from Brandon Brooks. And that thing is just awesome. So 
all right justin taylor there is my pipe collection as of now um hope you enjoy the video um if you have any questions where i got these pipes or anything like that or if anybody likes them um just go ahead and shoot me a uh, comment or something and i would be glad to tell you guys so you guys can pick some up as well hope you all are having a good day and i will talk to you guys later